So, you want to export your model from Blender to Quixel Mixer and have a texture there? That is very easy, just follow along and I will show you a neat way how you can easily assign colors and bake a map automatically with a free plugin. So, if that sounds something for you, just follow along with this tutorial. You will make your lives easier by looking up Text Tools Blender inside of Google. The first one should be a GitHub page, click that one. Then go to Code and download zip file and just leave it as a zip file. Then follow me into Blender. Go to Edit, Preferences, Add-ons, and install the add-on that you just downloaded as a zip file. And then you should look up Text Tools, and this checkbox should be enabled. Then you can follow along. Now, I have a simple table right here. And what we do before we go UV unwrapping is shift selecting all the parts and then hit Ctrl J to join them in one single object. Now, go to UV editing and make sure everything is selected. I like to have my face selection. So if you somehow misclick, hit A to select everything and make sure that these vertices are link selected. Then here, go to U and then Smart UV Project. I set the island margin about this because that way it leaves some space in between and there is no overlapping or bleeding. Okay, now you can make this better and scale it up to fit the picture like this, but this should too. Then hit N or just this icon right here and look up for text tools. We are going to need the color ID. I'm going to color every separate part that I want later on in Mixer. For me that will be the tabletop and then the legs of the table. I hit numpad 1 so I can select more easy Alt C to go in wireframe mode. And what I can do now is select this part and then assign a color to this. Just like that. Okay. Then the table X. Let's assign a different color for this. And I only need two colors. This is fine for me for this example. Now, if you need more colors, instead of five coats, you can select rainbow, for example, or change the colors right here. Okay, so this is all colored in. Alt C to go back into solid view mode. These colors are assigned to red and blue, because later on I can assign materials inside Quixer to the red and the blue value right here. What we can do now is go to baking, and instead of here to normal, we're going to use the material ID. Great. And then you're going to use bake. And you sit, should see something like this. So my red ones are colored in like this. And my legs here are colored in like this. Okay, nice. Image. Save as. Let's save this to the desktop and save as image. Go back to layout right now. And what I'm now going to do is go here to the material properties. And I'm going to delete the materials of my table right here. I find that this works a little bit better inside of Quixel Mixer and gives less errors. Because we are going to use our color mask. Have your table selected. File. Export. And export as FBX. Again to the desktop. And limit to the selected objects. And then export once more. Then we can go to Quixel Mixer. Inside of Quixel Mixer, choose new mix. Give it a fitting name. And hit OK. Now we don't need a plane, we need a custom model. So look up the one that we just had. And now here comes the magic under material ID. Click here, texture set editors and find here material ID. And this is the map that we created in Blender and open that one up right here. And right now, when I can go to layers, for example, let's add a smart material. Let's choose, for example, something like metal. Okay. And let's also choose a smart material. Let's look up a wood. And this wood might do okay. Now, we are going to assign these materials to the tabletop and to the legs. Now you can right click and add ID mask or short hit the I key. And you can see, you can select the mask right here. And you just can click whatever you want or hold the Q button because this is the wood. Hold Q and you can tick the legs or tick the tabletop and I click the tabletop and it's assigned. I do the same here. Hit I, create a mask. This is the metal. I hold Q and then select the legs right there. And you can see that all the legs, by the way, hold Alt to rotate here, are colored inside of this metal. And right now we have our tabletop textured right here in Quixel Mixer. 
Now go to export if you want to export this to a game engine for example, choose the maps you want and hit file quick export. If you want to see me exporting this material right into Unreal Engine, look in the description down below, there should be a link there how I do that. Hey.